just discovered about, um, you know, we should probably do another record about three, five months ago. And um, we just discovered we had all these songs. And they all do, they, they, they either have something to do with, with um, as I say, longing and belonging. And they're, they're raucous. We're raucous. We're not sad. We're not sad at all. Um, uh, so we, you know, there's things about drinking. And there's songs about Mark has a 1956 Dodge Coronet. And um, our uh, lovely designer, Jules Baum, has a, 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 a 19... Uh, 57 uh, Ford Ranch Wagon that's made into a dragster. So we wrote a song about those cars because they're fun. And um, also, you know, again, we're, you know, we've kind of, people have, there's loads of songs about cars. We thought we'd add to that uh, category. And depending on where we're playing, if it's a sit down, because sometimes we play sit down, we mix it up a little bit more. We have more light and shade. Uh, and, um, but we're definitely, the first order of the day is to have fun, and because uh, we have fun, that's why we do it, uh, and, and we want everybody else to have fun, and 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 to bring a little bit of that kind of old, that older sort of get up and dance, you know, rockabilly, if it's rockabilly or if it's old blues or jug band music, um, which was all really about everybody getting together and having a few drinks and and getting up and dancing. And that is, um, that's really what we're about. And so that's why we can laugh about, you know, transport and homicide or interpersonal conflict with high powered weaponry, you know, because it's funny and it's fun. So, so you're up singing a song about, uh, um, you know, Stagger Lee, for example, or, or uh, uh, somebody riding on a, uh, on a train and, uh, 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 you know, crashing it, you know, it's, uh, um, that's fun. You know, trains are rhythmic. The road is rhythmic. The rhythm of the road uh, uh, is rhythmic. And sometimes I think we do get a little bit wistful occasionally, but only that's just to bring that temperature down a little bit and then to, to, to bring it back up. Uh, well, this is a, a, a Dobro, and it's made by a guy down in Austin, Texas, who has a company called Republic. I mean, the classic Dobros are nationals. Um, and that was, that's an old company. This is an old tricone style, uh, which was the first kind of dobro, and it's got sort of three cones in it that resonate, and, uh, and, it, uh, and then this, this covers the base. Uh, it's got a, it's a copper, it's brass with a copper wash, and I love it. It just has a particular sound, I think, you know, it just differentiates. I'm either playing that kind of stuff or I'm playing a, 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 this, this uh, electric, uh, here, which is a 1957 Epiphone Zephyr. Um, this actually isn't my guitar, this is Mark's guitar. Uh, he bought it because when we started playing together, he saw this and, I, and it's a good, he got a great deal on it. He, he recognized it. It was it's one that made in one of the last years that uh, Epiphone was its own company before they were bought out by Gibson and it's got a Darman pickup on the, up here on the neck and it's just got a particular sound. I've never played another guitar that sounds like this. At Sun Studios, I played an, an ES-295 that they had there, which was the same kind of guitar Scotty Moore played. And then um, I've mixed this and the, the, the Gretsch uh, Anniversary and, and, and this guitar. And so this is for the raucous stuff. This is for the contemplative stuff. But actually, this can get raucous too. <laughs>